we can't fight ISIS without Turkey because of the border. Any attempt to overthrow a democratic government, even if it's a democratic government that's doing things very differently than we would do them, is troubling. Um, and so, you know, our hope is that uh, President Erdogan, uh, having resisted the coup, um, obviously there will be consequences, but they should be consequences, you know, within the norms of what a democracy do, would do, protecting human rights and not going overboard and penalizing people for participating in politics. He's entitled to make his pick, you know, so I don't really have any comments on it right now. I mean, I, I you know, I don't know Governor Pence. The only real way I know him is because of the controversy of his activities to really crack down on LGBT and then that, that, that controversy. Um, some of the other things that I would view as kind of anti-civil rights, that's very different than, than the way we want to do things. Um, but Trump's entitled to make his pick, and I'm sure more on that later. We, had, we talked about everything. We talked about the, you know, the, just the state of the race. But mostly what we talked about is Virginia, that Virginia had not been in anybody's you know, um, list of the states where you should really do a lot of competition because we were so non-competitive up until 2008. And with that vigorous crowd there, you know, it was fun to talk about how the fact that you know, Virginia now is relevant. That was good. Hey, NBC News fans, thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking on that button down here and click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights, and digital exclusives. Thanks for watching.